Welcome back, guys. Uh, we have a little bit of money to work with. We have around 17 and a half million uh, to work with. So what I want to do is I want to get our ship lines rate up quite a bit. We are making kind of money. Uh, you can see we have some dodgy months or years, but uh, then we have some very, very good years. But yeah, that's what we want to do. And of course, we want to do this to get everything moving a little bit faster. Uh, we have a demand of 27 bricks up here, 112 down here. So that's already, uh, what, 140 or so? Uh, that are being demanded and we want to increase our production uh, because we have demand down here as well in Fargo and Scottsdale and I would kind of like our ships to bring some uh, our ships to bring some of the bricks back and take them to Scottsdale and Fargo mm. by train and maybe even Sunnyvale, but I'm not really sure about that. We'll, we'll figure that out. So, let's borrow all the money. Because it's borrowing $30 million is always a good thing, right? And let's let the game play on. Uh, because I want to wait a little bit to buy these ships. Uh, we can buy a couple now. Uh, buy vehicles. Uh, so we did get the Schaffhausens. Which is a better ship. But I think I'm going to stick with the Klondikes. And we'll buy three right now. And put you on there. Then we of course have this line here. Um where, uh, what is our rate on this right now? 129. So what I wanna do is replace our trucks uh, with the Benz to Poland trucks. Let's do that. That'll get all of that work moving a little bit faster. Actually, how fast can a Benz to Poland truck go? Uh, 40 and this road can do for you so it's fine for now okay and what did that get the rate up to for that 150 so clone those That should give us a rate of around 300. And where are all the ships? They're here. Wait just a little bit to buy the next ones. Okay. How's our train looking? It has 74 on board. 100 and 48 waiting to go to Sacramento. I'd really like to get more going to uh, to San Antonio. All right, now we're getting full or empty. But here comes the ship. So there's a bit for our trucks to pick up. Yeah, I think after this ship comes in, will be a good time to um, to buy some more. Come on. So we have 19 million right now. So we actually made money, even though we spent money, quite a lot of money. We actually made money there. 
So that's nice to see. Uh, buy vehicles, uh, Klondike, let's buy five. And set you on that line. And let's see what the rate says here now. 333. We're getting there. Now, of course, down here, we need to update those rates as well. And the first thing that we're going to do is replace all these with the Benz Tarpaulins so they go a little bit faster. And what is the rate on this line? 287, so we don't need to double it. Uh, so how about we take four of these off and clone? 476, that's too much. But we'll see. You know what, let's sell a couple. Come on. Uh, so, two, or 29, I'm good with that. And we'll see once they're actually here, if that's right. So how much do we have sitting down here? 228. What is going on there? Ah. Okay, we'll see once this all gets going. We have these ships here. It says a rate of 333. Let's buy two more. Set you on that. And see what the rate says now. 374. Alright. I'll buy one more. I'll buy one more. Okay. There. And what does this say about rate now? 453. That's a little bit too much. So... Let's sell one. And let's keep this line open. 446. Four thirty seven. Or twenty seven. Or sixteen. That's probably as good as it's gonna get. We could maybe get away with selling one more. But I think this is fine. Okay. New industries. Have a lot of ships coming down. No ships coming up. And there's one coming up with 110. 110. Uh, 110. 110 you'll get 110 good so this should get all of this going very nicely which is good and we can repay a little bit of money, I guess. Three and a half mil. But this should get things moving along. Uh, our train is not sitting here. Uh, it's on its way. Where is it? Where's our train? That's well, coming in here, I guess. Yep. Okay. Ooh, we could do with a little bit more capacity here, couldn't we? 
We don't have the money for that right now. We'll we'll leave it a little bit. But let's take a look at our lines and see how they're doing. So our ships are losing money right now. That's understandable. Uh, two of our passenger lines are actually slightly in the green right now, which is wonderful. Um, our fuel to San Antonio is doing okay. Our tools is doing okay. Yeah. Okay. Oh, we can actually afford it. Well, we could afford it. Hmm. We could afford it. Has the train already delivered again? No, no, it's sitting here. Heavyweight 281 parlor with speed of 180 kilometers an hour. That's really not necessary right now. That's really not necessary right now. 396, it's close. And once all this spreads out a bit, I think it'll be just fine. How much did you get? 35. We really need to get this moving a bit faster. Uh, how much is waiting? 21 only. We really need to get our trucks moving. Which means, because they're waiting for a full load, so... Basically need this to go up. Oh, Sacramento wants food. Sacramento wants machines. Okay. And what about up here? How is Grand Prairie looking? It's not getting a whole lot of food. Um, how about we uh, replace these with these? It cost us a million, so we can't do it right now. Uh, hopefully soon. Come on. Give us some money. That was the wrong way. Come on. Give us some money. More money. Even more money. You can do it. No, no wrong way. Dang it. Come on! No, we're almost there, I think. There. Alright. That should give this a little bit of a better rate. Still not a great rate. We could do with some more trucks on there, but... Something like this. And as soon as we can, we can, will clone. Not yet. Certainly not now. Ah. Get in there. And... We are struggling a little bit for profits right now, I feel like. Which isn't a good thing. But I think... Oh, ship coming in there. Okay. 
gets so close and then it just kicks our feet up from under us. Just a little bit more. More, more. One of the big ones, come on. Nope. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. One more big one, come on. There we go. Okay. What does it look like? So we lost money, but we spent a million. Lost three million there without spending anything. So that's not a good sign. I'm a little bit worried, guys. I'm a little bit worried. Just a tad. Oh, Grand Prairie wants fuel now. And goods. Outstanding. Towns are growing. Towns are a growing. So you come out with 110, 89, 35, 31, 19, 24, 34, 21, 15, 13, 14. And this isn't good. Oh, we got the Mikado. And we got Mac trucks as well. Okay, okay. Are you starting to see more shipment and transport? I really want this to be fully blue. If that is a blue color, it looks blue to me. It might be green, but I am not sure. Uh, so one thing that we could do, because every time we come in here, basically some of it falls off, right? I think so I think we'll put actually let's bulldoze that and see if we can get nope I didn't think so so a large cargo building there and there that Gives us enough room. More than enough room. So that's good. And I don't think we need it over here. Yeah, we definitely don't. Uh, what would be nice is to make some more room here as well, I think. So let's configure you, and we can extend this a bit, which I want to do. And then I want to put a large cargo building in there. I really like this feature that we now have the cargo buildings that actually have capacity and functionality. That is a really nice addition to the game. Uh, you're waiting to go to San Antonio South. There's 240 something sitting waiting to go down to Sacramento. It's a little bit annoying that it doesn't kind of split it evenly. I wish you could tell it to do that. I really do. So you're coming in with 35. Okay, so we'll be fine. Uh, so how much do you have? You have 44 right now, 46, 47, 48, 
for nine. So it is getting there, it's just really slow. It's just really slow. Okay. Well, we have some money. We can repay a bit. That's nice. So we made seven million there. See that? That's what I'm talking about. I like that. All right, it's more than half full now. But if stuff starts falling off for Sacramento, then it's really not worth having this sitting here waiting for a full load. So I think, uh, so San Antonio, so when you're going to San Antonio, I think I'll go not with unlimited time, but five minutes. Five minutes you can wait. Uh, what does the ship line right now uh, say? 396, so we could do with one more ship in reality. And we had the money. We had the money. Let's set you one there. Very empty down in this end, isn't it? You must have got a full load, yeah. Uh, why are you bringing back 30 bricks? Seriously. Why are you bringing back 30 bricks? Uh, is it going to drop those bricks off here? Do it streetcar. Okay. Cool, cool. Uh, drop, drop them off here. And it's not overloaded because this now can hold 181. Nice. Whoa, look at all the passengers here. 104 passengers waiting there. 20 and 41 waiting here. And up here we have 33 waiting. So getting those towns growing a little bit really helped out. On the passenger numbers. Not on uh, the trains making money, but on the passenger numbers. Okay, are these trucks running a little bit more regularly now? No. So, rate of 214, we can have a much higher rate than that. Six, seven, go. Six, seven, go. All right, so hopefully this is starting to pick up then. Transport 100%, shipment 200, 400. And that's of course because we don't have more demand. So what that tells me is that we want to save up some money So that we can build this line down here. Yep, 
Yeah. Yeah. I do know that there is a bricks factory there and a quarry there, but I really want the ships to bring back bricks so that they're making money in both directions. Sacramento is accepting machines and food. Oh, the towns are growing. The towns are growing. It's wonderful. really is wonderful. You come up with 108 only. That's not so wonderful. Yes. We don't have enough demand for m more, so I guess it makes sense. See, 138. So, San Antonio now wants 33. And you want 106. So, where's the other demand for this? Because it has a shipment of 200 or 400. Uh, but here, yeah, 141. See? So the the shipment down there is these 200. And that's why we don't need the full load right now. So that is costing us a bit of money. No doubt about that. No doubt about that. 110, 110. 110, 83, 28, 110, yeah, so right now we're really not utilizing our ships to their full extent or these trucks, which kind of sucks. So, what we could do is set up a train station down here and tell our train here to send bricks down here. That would increase our demand some, get Sunnyvale growing. So, and that wouldn't cost that much to do. So I think we're going to cut this one a little bit short and in the next one we'll start delivering bricks to Sunnyvale as well. Columbia wants brick as well. That's much more expensive though. Because then we'll have to go straight through here and that is going to be an expensive tunnel. So yeah, next time we'll hook up Sunnyvale with uh, bricks and get a little bit more demand going for uh, for bricks so that we make the most out of our brick line here. So thank you very much for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.